Hello. Um, so I just wanted to make an update because um, I have not in a long time. Um, but I moved again. Yay! I calculated it and I have moved like 11 times in and out of places. 11 plus or minus. I think it's plus like one or two that I'm forgetting. Um, I moved that many times, but finally I'm in my new place that'll be for a year. Um, I'm with my roommate who actually I lived with last year um, and she came back and now we're roommates again which is super awesome because I missed her a lot <laughs> and I finally got my whole room set up um, my poster board is blank my cork board because I have not had time to like really actually sit there because school also started like two days ago um, so I thought I'd make an update though while I'm here I'm waiting for my boyfriend to get out of hockey um so he should be out pretty soon and then I will go over to his house but um I set up I'll just give you a quick little <laughs> there's my closet I hung up some late um solar system this is my bed <laughs> um that's the outside door these are some posters from Europe and then this is my bathroom it looks decently clean in here, weirdly enough. Um, but, gosh, oh, this is a candle that I, is blocking the view. It's tea tree and spearmint, and I can't really smell it, but that's actually kind of nice because I had one that was super strong, and I did not like the smell at all. But this one is, like, super subtle, and I really like it. It's probably one of the best. I think it was five bucks. This size was five dollars, and I was like, sure. And like I don't use it too often but I do enough and like I feel like it hasn't melted as much um, so that's kind of cool I was gonna see if it had like a longevity thing or something like how many hours it offers 25 25 hours um, I don't know I just wanted to start off with uh, I've been going to the gym recently um connor has really gotten me into going like every single day of the week <laughs> and um it's actually been super nice because i made a lot of progress today and that's actually super beneficial to me like wanting to go again and again because at first it was really hard like going to the gym especially like with no muscle at all like now i have now i have just a little bit you know for being skinny <laughs> um but like today I was doing like squats and then RDLs and when I first went to the gym it was really hard because all I could do was lift a 45 pound bar and that was really hard for me but because we were doing arms and legs and back I was working out all those muscles and getting stronger in my arms and then also just building up the muscle that I had in my legs um, and I'm definitely not lifting as heavy as I should be uh, because I start off I do a warm up with like just the bar and then I start tacking on more and more weights um, like every set that I go, but I'm still, I'm, you know, going up and down easy. Um, but what I really wanted to do was learn good form. Um, and like, make sure I like, no, before I like lift something too heavy and like struggle and then not be able to like lift myself correctly, I'm lifting lighter, but practicing form. Um, and that's been really nice. So I don't know, but, um, pretty much that has been super awesome to finally actually like get rewarded in the gym <laughs> um hold on okay sorry it was super hot in here and so i just turned on the ac um but anyways um so that's really cool i just started school school is great the, the hardest part about school right now is actually like parking um the parking scene has been atrocious i forget how many people are here i didn't buy a parking pass this year um, so I'm kind of just raw dogging it every time I go to school, um, and it's only been three days, but, um, it is not for the week. The only thing that I did do was, um, I biked to school one of the days, which I think if I went to the gym, did cardio, and then ate how I'm eating, I will get pretty healthy. I'm, I'm on, I feel like I should be on my fitness journey. I kind of let myself go, and by let myself go, I just did not go to the gym as much. Um, I'm still skinny though because my metabolism burns like no other, so I would have to say that's the one privilege of myself is that instance. Um, but 
Anyways, uh, I have to find my passport. I don't know where it went. It has been super, super hot. Um, where we are, it's like been 100 degrees every single day. And walking and like biking out is just... I, don't, I, I would not wish this on my worst enemy. Like, it is just terrible. It is, like, you're sweating every single day. It is, I'm ready for the winter. Like, I miss my home. I'm ready for the winter. I really don't want to be, like, sitting in here anymore. Uh, and just be, like, constantly just dripping. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll see. You know, actually, I was just thinking about this really quick. This arm is weaker than this arm, but I feel like I can't see as much muscle in that one, you know? Also, you can't really see very mus mu much muscle anyways, because I don't have any, but, but what's important is I know I'm getting stronger, even if I can't see it. Uh, but yeah, these are my new updates. Um, my job over the summer was fun. I can't really talk about it because it's the government, um, but it was really cool to build a new project and learn more electrical engineering stuff. Uh, really that's the point of that job is to like get a first hand look at electrical engineering as like what it is in the working world. Um, gosh my face is so dry. Um, and that's why I was mentioning the heat because it's just so dry here. Everything is dry. <laughs> um, I'm also super tired too. Anyways. Um, but that, that went really well, and I've kept it part-time. The only thing I have to figure out is, again, this parking situation is, like, stressing me out. So I have to figure out, like, how I'm going to park and also go to work and, like, just balance it all. Um, I don't know if I should have just bought a parking pass earlier. I don't know why I didn't. I think I just kind of thought that it would be easier than it is. So that's, like, my fault. Um, but, I mean, no one really... I didn't really expect it to be like that, and actually nobody else did. I mean, the level of freshmen that are here is crazy, and they're taking up all of our spots. But, um, yeah, my classes are good. I'm taking two, oh my gosh, two political science classes. Um, and then, of course, I'm taking my engineering classes, too. The poli sci classes are going to be fun. They're just, you know, basic. They're pretty much like political science themed English classes. Um, and my engineering actually seems <coughs> pretty, sorry, pretty normal. Um, I guess because I've taken so many engineering classes that it like doesn't really bother me, you know? Why? I need to like fix my. Okay. I need to take off my makeup and just generally fix my dry skin, but for right now it's just so hot that I just like. It's kind of impossible, um, but I don't know. It's, anyways, uh, new topic. I was looking at my plants earlier today. Um, I have three of them. I um, took one apart and then I just put it into another pot. So now I took one plant and turned it into two. And then I also just got another one about six months ago um, through my boyfriend's roommate and um, Anyways, I was looking at the original plant that I had, the one that I split into two, and I realized that I had got that plant, like, literally, like, around this time last year from Home Depot, I think. Um, it's with people I hate. I don't talk to them at all anymore because they're absolutely booty holes. Um, but, because I had some bad roommate issues last year. Um, but now that that's over with. <laughs> um. I realized that I had gone with them and I bought that plant. I was like, wow, I've kept a plant alive for a year. <laughs> um, I think I've always had a, well, also the fact that I was able to like split the plant in two was really cool. Um, I feel like that's actually kind of nice is that I'm not dumb enough to just kill a plant right away. Um, it's September, at least expire in September. If there's, serving says one capsule is 60, so this is two months worth. Um, so I need to either use them now or lose them. Um, but anyways, when did these expire? Oh my gosh, these expire in a long time. <laughs> I really would like to use those up though. Um, anyways, I also have a fish now, again. <laughs> um, the last fish I owned was with my ex-boyfriend and then I have no idea what happened to it. I know it died. It was not doing well because he wanted to stupidly add shrimp 
to the tank and that introduced like some bacteria. So never go to Clark's Emporium, um, Pet Emporium, because they they have bacteria in their fish tanks and uh, completely kill their fish, I guess. Um, but I did not own a fish. And then um, Connor's roommate, the one that gave me that other plant, also gave me a fish for free in a really nice tank. It's like a fish bowl actually, instead of like a whole tank. And then it's rose quartz on the bottom instead of like aquarium gravel. Um, and then it has like a little bubble, like oxygen filter, a heater, and then like a little, a little sleeping bed. Um, and every morning I, I give, uh, his name is Ghost, Ghost Anthony Malone. Anthony and Malone were both, um, name suggestions by my roommate. Um, and so that's his official name. <laughs> um, Ghost was my idea because he's an all white beta fish. And I don't know if it's a he, I think beta fish look the exact same, so I have no idea. Um, but yeah, so now I have a fish. I kept a plant alive for a year. I got another plant. School started. Parking sucks. School seems to be pretty good so far. And I'm making gains at the gym, which is cool. That's like a pretty much a good summary of what's been going on right now. Um, I definitely miss the summer. Um, me and Connor went camping like almost every single weekend for a while. Uh, and then we both had our respective like trips that we had. We had like end of summer vacation trips. I went on a cruise to Mexico with my best friend and her family. And then he went fishing with his dad. Um, and then what else? And then we like just had different things, but he does hockey full time, um, which actually I was gonna check if he texted me or not. Not yet, I mean, he's still in hockey. Um, so he's doing that and I have my own life here, so. <laughs> I'm kind of bored though at the moment. I think I'm gonna finish, I'm trying to finish reading this book. Um, I've been reading it for a long time, but I just never sit down long enough, but I've literally made almost all this progress in just today. I'm a really fast reader. I love books. I love books. Literally the best gift to ever get me is just a romance novel that like has some weird color combination, some modern looking cover. Usually that'll be like a fiction novel for me that I really enjoy. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to finish that one, so I think after I finish this and upload it, <laughs> I'm gonna finish reading it, or at least try. <laughs> My head kind of hurts, though, and I'm really tired, so we'll see. Um, I really want to go to bed, and I really don't want to, like, drive all the way to his house, because it's, like, 15 minutes away, which is not that far, but, like, still, I'm so tired, <laughs> and it would be a lot easier if I could just sleep in. But I also want to go to the gym. I don't know what I'll. I will make that decision when he gets out of hockey. Um, it's definitely a lot different summer versus uh, school. We have a lot less time, so that'll be interesting to kind of navigate. Because um, the last boyfriend I had, the one that I owned the fish with, he would disappear to uh, nature for the whole summer. So I didn't see him either. So this is the first time where I actually had a boyfriend during the summer, um, and like had like literally we spent every single spent every single day together, um, which is actually insane. Um, and R.I.P. to some of my uh, friend social time, but I still I I was good. I did fine. Um, and now school is different, um, except not really because I see him every single day. Um, because we both do the same major, we're both electrical engineering, so I was like, so it's not really that big of a deal. Um, it's just different because we're in school mode. Um, because I'm not really big into like PDA and stuff. Like, it's nice if you claim your boyfriend or whatever, but also at the same time, like, I'm there for a reason. I pay however much money I pay every single semester, um, to go to school, not to get a boyfriend. So, I love the man, but also. It's different. I don't know. Um, that sounds so negative, but it's really not. I'm just saying that, like, I understand there's a reason for certain changes in life. Um, also, I've been staring at these the whole time. They're tiny little. <laughs> wait, I'm gonna take a. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, that's the cover of this video. <laughs> 
Um, these are two. I don't know if they're Yoshi's. I don't know what the other ones are, but, um, oh, I thought they moved. <laughs> okay, um, I broke it. Okay, tiny apple in, in the basket. Okay, and now I need to make sure, I'm gonna put this right here. Oh, I also broke her. Okay, she's not sitting on her thing. Okay, so I built this one, and then Connor built Minecraft. He really likes Minecraft, so he built this one. Is that a llama? That's to oh no, it's a camel. I didn't know there was a camel in this one. Um, I'm the best girlfriend ever, and I got him Minecraft Legos because he said he wanted one from Costco that was like eighty dollars, and I was like, no. I was like, I'm not. I make government money, but. You do not get that one, that one. I don't even buy that. I do not buy that for myself, so I will not buy it for other people. Oh, he texted me. Oh, and then also I thought this was um, Toothless, but actually I hear it's just a phantom, which I don't really know what that is because I never played Minecraft. Like, I never played survival or survival mode. I only did creative, um, so I don't really know all the creatures and stuff. But I always just had stuff in my like inventory. And so when we were playing yesterday, Cause he set up like a communal server because he just got this mini pc um i uh we started to play it right and um i was like i don't i don't know how to make a sword i don't know how to make an axe i don't know how to collect wood and he was like bro um but so that's fun we're gonna start playing video games more often um as kind of an out from from school and stress. Um, if you just want to know what, look at that. Is that a bug? Oh no, that's a feather. That's a feather. I was like, is there a mosquito in my book? <laughs> I was about to be concerned. So this is my math book. This is the last math I ever have to take. It's called Introduction to Probability, and it's pretty much just like I'm gonna give you the the question that we were given today. Well, kind of just food for thought, which is if you had four shirts three pants and two shoes how many outfits can you make out of that and so we just kind of went with um if you have four shorts or four shirts and three pairs of pants you can make 12 total outfits and then with each of the shoes you double that because you can make one outfit with this shoe and one outfit with this shoe so then it's like 24 um outfits and then it's it's just a lot of like different combinations and i i go to bed thinking about that kind of stuff which is really weird like at least that's how I know that engineering is probably the right path for me because I like go to bed thinking about math and like doing problems in my head like I'm like okay if I have this thing and this thing and how many things of this can I make how many iterations uh, but that's probability if you flip a coin you know 50 times um, how many times are you gonna get like heads how many times are you gonna get kills so it's 50% chance that's so it's 25 head 25 tails plus or minus a few um because that's just based on odds but um we have our first homework assignment that hopefully he'll post the second part of the problem because we're missing that um but the book is really different than what we're learning in class i'm not gonna lie like it's just i don't know it's it's not like <laughs> i this is this is a lot different than what we're doing in class uh, but anyways, I'm so tired. I think I'm gonna go to bed. We'll see if I go over. Maybe not. It's kind of late. Um, but thanks for listening to me an update. Um, I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> and uh, I will talk to you tomorrow. Well, probably not, but later. <laughs>